take a look here at uh, uh, domestic auto inventories. Uh, this is not just at low levels. This is at historically low levels, worse than the great, great financial crisis, worse than what Munger bought uh, Tenneco here. But you can see this is a regular cycle. So this is the estimated worldwide motor vehicle production from uh, 2000 to last year. You can see the dip here when Munger bought Tenneco. You can see it during the great financial crisis. You can see it during the great pandemic. And it's just a regular pattern. It dips and then it recovers. It dips and then it recovers. And if you look here at the IHS uh, so industry survey, they're expecting it to uh, get back well above 2017 levels over the next few years. And uh, Cooper Standard has guided that uh, uh, while IHS is projecting 5.9% compound annual growth rate of vehicle production, uh, Cooper Standard is projecting total sales growth of 9% compound annual growth rate over that period. And that's what gets us to $3.4 billion with double digit EBITDA margins. The stock could be earning eight, $9 a share, 10, 20 times multiple, uh, depending on uh, the sentiment at the moment. But uh, you do the math, the stock's trading at $9 now. Uh, you could really have a serious multi-bagger in our view. Uh, 